fishing planet. And even though I had already made it to California, guess what? We've got us another event, and this one is for the Christmas and the holiday season. And I'm going to go ahead and let you know what the situation is here. It's called Christmas Vacation. Dear friends, your support and constructive criticism alike have kept us going so far in creating a whole parallel universe, the Fishing Planet Universe, that shall serve to unite all who think, feel, and dream alike. And so this holiday season, we're prepared to have a special present for you, a trip to Canada for a magically snowy fishing vacation. Hurry up, all trips to Canada from December 19th through January 11th are completely free of charge. Don't forget to grab a valid fishing license before you go. New fish, fireworks, friends function, and much, much more awaits. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Cool. New Lake, Canada. Moose, White Moose Lake, Alberta. Free transfer to White Moose Lake from Level 5 for Christmas celebration event. License discounts for event duration. Fireworks. Lots of new fish across the board, friends and gift systems, updated line physics, sleeves customization based on what you wear, new items, achievements, rewards, and much more. And here's a real cool thing. Legend has it that the furry trout is more ferocious than the Himalayan Yeti, more ruthless than the Loch Ness Monster, and yet, is it even real? So many tales and stories devoted to this mysterious water dweller. But despite the common disbelief in this fantastic creature's existence, the legendary fur-bearing trout is said to have been spotted somewhere far up north, in some deep cold-water glacial mountain lake. Apparently a place with such climatic conditions that even the toughest of fish had to evolve and adapt to its severity. Who knows, perhaps there's some truth to these rumors. What do you think? If so, who will be the first to catch this dangerously merciless floof? <laughs> they actually came up with a Bigfoot of types. It's wonderful. Alright, looks like we're ready, guys. And we got our daily bonus. Alright, we are actually going to go check that out. Yeah, I actually caught a trophy steelhead, guys, in my first trip there, and I, fortunately I didn't record it, but I will put up the picture of this monster that I caught so that you can see that he's for real. And, looks like we need to get us a license, so let's see, where would that be? Okay, over here, Alberta. Oh, 
Oh wow. Here we are guys. We've got snow. It says stall and snow are a sure sign of great fishing in winter. Try fishing around caverns and areas with steep bottom terrain. Your best bet is to fish in the morning and evening hours. So we got snowy weather to deal with. Let's see. and I'll bring it back and we'll be ready to go. Alright guys, I am back and here we go guys. It is 5 a.m. and it looks like the best times are 7 and 6 in the evening on cloudy days. It looks like if it's sunny, you want to come out around Sunny days are the best days, apparently. Alright, let's do it. See what we shall see. Catch what we can catch. Oh, that is so cool. Look at that, guys. Got us a Christmas tree and everything. And a nice roaring fire to keep warm. Well, this is cool, guys. I like this. Very nice, very nice. I'm just going to kind of take a look around here real quick. Looks like you can run all the way down here. So it's not just that one spot. You can fish anywhere along here. And I'm telling you, that right there looks like a good spot. Yeah, I think I'm going to advance time just a tad here to 7 a.m. and we're gonna see what we can catch in here. I'm gonna cast it all the way over here right next to that log. Alright. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow! Holy crap! Oh this is gonna be this is gonna be so fun. I don't know what I've got, but we're going to find out. Weapon X works well here, Dula. Weapon X works well. I have no idea what I've got. I mean, this is all new. I better be ready with my snapshot. I mean, this, is, I mean, this could be just a bath. It could be trout I don't know we will find out soon enough here what do we got here guys ooh nice northern pike guys check it out check it out we'll get us a nice picture of that oh and we even got some fireworks to go with it <laughs> yes, that's great. That is so cool. I guess every time you do that, you get, catch something. Alright, we're going to try it right back over here again. Alright, we'll let it go down. We'll see what we shall see. Alright. All right. Nothing happened there. All right, let's try. Let's try a lift and drop. See if that does anything. Cause I didn't even have a chance to try anything before he attacked it. Just let it go to the bottom. We'll put it up to two. And let's see if that gets his attention.
There we go. Got something. Got something. Okay, it jumped. So... Didn't get a good look at it. I don't think it's as big as what it got last time, but... I think it might be another pike, guys. I'm not sure. We're going to see here. Yep, it's another pike. Yeah, there we go. We'll keep him, too. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. We're going to increase the size of our lure here. Because they obviously like that. That'll also get us a little more range. I'd like to get out to this log if I can. Some deep water here, guys. Deep water. I'm gonna do a stop and go this time. So, a little bit. Alright, nothing on that. Doesn't mean it doesn't work, but I'm not gonna try anything that doesn't work right off the bat, because we got a lot of lake here to check out. I think what I'm going to do is a straight slow and just keep moving. Sorry about my bird. I don't know what is his problem, her problem, whatever. This, let's get out on the stock. Yeah, I think that drop off right there. That could be a really good spot, but I'm going to switch my bait here real quick. I'm going to use a medium spoon, half ounce, and then I'm going to try spinners. And I'm going to try it right, looks like there's a little alcove right over here too. That might be a good spot, guys. We're going to try the old lift and drop. Not the lift and drop. Stop and go. Okay, we're going to try twitching this time. Like I said, it's really deep water. Yep, there's a lot of snags. Alright, I got something. I got something this time. What have I got? What have I got? What have I got? Wow! Trophy Yellow Perch! Wow! Well, that was impressive, and I didn't even know these guys were in here. Huh. What says, press and hold the right mouse button, or X, to examine your catch? Oh man, that's new. Check it out. I love that. That is wonderful. Yep, I'm gonna keep him. <laughs> that's new, I love it. Alright, let's see here. Well, that obviously worked. <laughs> okay, we're going to do another steady twitching.
Got something else. Let's see what we've got here, people. Could be another yellow perch. Could be something altogether different. What do we got? Another perch? Yep. Wow. Lots of those guys in there. <laughs> I like that. Alright, let's see. What else can we try here, guys? I mean, this is all, like I said, this is all brand new. So we have no earthly idea what's going to happen with all this. Let's see. I'll tell you what, let's try fishing over there next to that wall. There's a lot of trees over there. Let's see, let me switch here. I want to try a spinner bait this time. I'm going to use the biggest one I have. Oh, not that one. This one. try right over here and just see if that does anything. Boy, it is deep, deep water, people. Dang. It's still sinking. It just now hit bottom. Wow. Alright, nothing so far. Let's try back over here. do a lift and drop and I'm going to do a very slow one. Whoa, something did it. Didn't take it, but he did bite. There we go. Got something. I think we got us another perch, though. Nope. Brook trout. Brook trout. I've never caught a brook trout before. Pretty little trout. The 
points are pretty high too. Lots of XP here. So what? We've got pike, perch, and brook trout so far, and I know there's lake trout because I've seen people catch those. And they do seem to like this spinner, so we're going to keep using that. Lift and drop seems to be doing the job. Quite a few snags, though. I'm really going to be interested in seeing what flow fishing does over here, too. Okay, what have I got here? Another brook trout, maybe? Yeah, we're about to find out. I think so. Yep, another brook trout. <laughs> this is fun, guys. This is a lot of fun. That's all I can say. Yeah, let's just try straight out and see what the heck interest might get interest interested. I can't seem to talk. I mean, we're just experimenting here, guys. Wow, this is some deep water. Deep, deep, deep. I think in the next episode I'm going to try some crankbait. I have no idea if that's going to have any effect with anything out here. But I definitely believe that it's worth a try. And before I quit in this particular episode, I think I'm going to go try this spinner over there at that other spot. something. I got me something, guys. I got me something and it's bigger than what I had before. But I don't want to let that darn tensionally. Oh, you are big. You are a big cuss. Come on. Don't you even think you're going to get away from me. I want to see what you are, man. I want to see what the heck you are, dude definitely want to see what you are. Come on, come on, fish. Come on, fish. Come on. Come on. You want to come see... You want to come talk to old Hawkeye. Come on. We want to take a nice picture of you and show you off to everybody. Come on. Boy, this is, this is a nice one. Whatever it is, it's nice. Whatever it is, it is nice, nice, nice. Alright. Let's see what we got here, people. Yeah! Lake Trout. Nice. Isn't he a pretty old guy? He is so nice. Let's get him over here in the light a little better. Yeah, we're going to take a picture of this, guys. We are taking a picture. 
You're so photogenic, my friend. Wow. Nice. All right, guys. That is a lot of fun here. I tell you, I am... I'm thrilled to death here. I am enjoying myself more than I've enjoyed. I've been grinding, trying to catch peacock bass over in Florida for like literally about two weeks. Because I've been, you know, I've hardly had any time with Christmas and other things going on. So this is a this is a treat, guys. But anyway, please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe, and come out here and try her out. Anyway. Take it easy, and I will talk at you later. Bye-bye.